Hi, I'm George Kirby, President and CEO of Ocean Power Technologies. OPT is a supplier of field-proven autonomous power solutions for defense, fisheries, oil and gas, and other offshore industries. Founded in 1994, OPT is a publicly traded company listed on the NASDAQ Stock Exchange, and we're based in New Jersey, USA. OPT engineers and produces turnkey offshore solutions and works with our global partners to provide integrated systems for surveillance, subsea power, and other applications. We currently have a power buoy system operating off the coast of Italy in the Adriatic Sea, and recently concluded the first phase of a surveillance project in the North Sea. Please take a few minutes to watch this video to learn more about our marine surveillance solution. Ocean Power Technologies has engineered a buoy-based solution to detect, identify, and track a range of vessels, including those with their Automatic Identification System, or AIS, signal turned off, day or night, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. The OPT surveillance system is comprised of the OPT power buoy, topside payload, and the software integration. The topside surveillance payload is made up of radar, an HD thermal imaging camera, AIS responder, communication systems, and antennas. We work with our customers to optimize the payload for their unique needs, which could include subsea acoustic and tsunami sensors or other equipment. The heart of the system is the OPT power buoy wave energy converter, which generates and stores electrical energy to power payloads and can send buoy and monitoring data to a land-based control station anywhere in the world. The vertical motion of the ocean waves moves the float up and down, which drives an input shaft. That input shaft spins a ball screw, which in turn spins the generator. The electricity generated from the generator is transferred to the battery packs. In this video, we will highlight some of the features of the OPT surveillance system, including system software integration, camera and radar capabilities, auto target acquisition at 10 nautical miles without AIS, thermal camera auto target lock and zoom capability. In May 2020, we worked with one of our partners to demonstrate the capabilities of our surveillance system on the shore of Galveston Bay in Texas. We are utilizing a state-of-the-art Furuno radar system which can automatically track and identify vessels at a significant range. This is a high-power Doppler radar capable of identifying vessels at ranges of 20 nautical miles. This high-definition Bosch camera with up to 30 times zoom is rugged and marinized for heavy seas. All of the equipment, including an AIS marine identification system, integrates with the powerful and flexible Time Zero monitoring and control software. In Time Zero, users can create monitoring zones, rules and actions, and automatically identify and track vessels entering the zone. In this example, the radar will use Automatic Radar Plotting Aids, or ARPA, to identify and track a vessel without using an AIS signal at 20 nautical miles. Radar power automatically increases as the range and gain is adjusted. Here, the ARPA radar system has identified and is tracking a target at about 20 nautical miles. The OPT surveillance system and Time Zero software can be configured to monitor multiple radar and camera feeds. The system can be expanded to incorporate multiple surveillance buoys to allow better monitoring of a larger area. Screens and monitoring devices can be customized by the user. The Furuno radar with ARPA capability can track multiple vessels, even with vessel AIS off. It will calculate the course, speed, and closest point of approach CPA, of a tracked object. The system tracks multiple objects compiled into a configurable on-screen list. We will now demonstrate detecting and tracking a black vessel, one with AIS identification system off. For this demo, we disconnected the AIS receiver on the test rig. We will create an auto-acquire zone and set it to the monitoring level. This will automatically detect any vessel coming into the zone and have the camera move to focus on the identified vessel. Here we zoom out to see the area of Galveston Bay that is being tracked on radar and zoom in on the center point of the equipment to the camera's current focal direction. It is currently fixed on a buoy approximately one nautical mile from the test rig and shows a vessel behind it. When a vessel progresses into the auto-acquire zone, we created a visual alarm that appears on the screen and an audio alarm can also be activated. Notice that the camera automatically pans to the zone to focus on the detected vessel. 
From here, we can click on the camera feed to fill the screen with the image of the vessel as it comes over the horizon. Here you can see the data from the same test rig operating in the same location at 9.30 p.m. on a moonless night on Galveston Bay in Texas. Along with the radar, the lower right corner of the screen shows a video feed. As we switch the camera to thermal imaging, you can see a much more detailed view of the ship. Switching over to the radar view, it shows it is tracking the ship that entered the caution zone we created. The buoy system tracks the vessel as it travels through the zone. We can zoom the camera view to see the details of the ship more closely. This camera is capable of a thermal zoom depending upon model. This model includes a four-time zoom for nighttime operation. Thanks for taking the time to learn more about OPT and our offshore surveillance solution. Please visit our website at www.oceanpowertechnologies.com to find out more about OPT and to contact us to discuss how OPT can provide solutions for your offshore challenges. Thank you.